yeah so okay so difference between ux and ui design i decided to use so this is my instagram app on my phone so what you're seeing is my phone's interface right so let's take a look at the first one so the first one you see that we have this <laughs> nice uh, instagram interface right the ux will be the layering of like how simple they've made the interface they they've laid their icons here to make sure that your navigation is easy and fast for you to understand everything i'm sure you know what this house means right this house icon you don't know what it means yes and then you know what this means this icon good so that's uh, the, your UX designer has made sure that you should be able to your UX designer has made sure that the layout should be easy for you to understand and then your UI designer the one that designed the icons for you to see and understand has made sure that these it will be things that you are familiar with that makes sense to you so you know as soon as you saw it you understood that is home can you see the difference between the home and then the other icons here? Well, no, it's selected. Like you see that it's selected. You see that it's selected here, but here it's not selected. Yeah, so that's the work of the UI designer as well. It, and that's the the is the ui designer is guiding your your visual direction right when you look at this you realize that this is not selected but this is selected you compare this to this you see this is lighter and this is bolder so the ui designer in a way is guiding your visual direction when you look at this page you realize that there are some uh this place is supposed to be like mainly for search i'm supposed to search for things that i'm looking for but then you realize that this place is not empty right they've provided certain content there for me and this is a this is customized to me like these particular content because i'm mainly doing ui ux research things related to design you see that in my search most of the things are like tech related stuff right that is ux design so the ux designer has made sure that if i go to the search the search page is not just empty before i even search for what i'm looking for i could get things that i'm interested in and these things could actually be one of the things that i was even going to type in my search box do you get it so in a way it makes my journey faster my journey in the app faster that is ux design do you get it that is ux design and ui design is the layering out making sure that the colors and everything is nice making sure that this text is big enough for you to be able to tap for your thumb to be able to tap inside making sure that you have the icon there and you have the text there for you to see that this is a search bar that's the rule of a ui designer here do you get it so that's the difference like this text you see here is actually on the video the video that the user of instagram posted so um this is supposed to be like an accessible feature for someone who can hear when you you see the words and the text on the screen you understand the messages that people the person is trying to put across do you get it yeah so it actually makes sense that's a ux design at uh, this one and then this one did you mention it as a ux design example or a ui design example the clock thing yeah the clock thing you mentioned up there did you mentioned that did you say it was a ui mm -hmm. okay so the clock being up there is the initiative of a ux designer and the fact that on a dark mode screen you have the color of the clock being white is a ui designer initiative imagine it's being imagine the color of the time being black on a dark 
a dark screen background do you think you'd have seen it no you wouldn't have seen the clock if they, it was black on a black background you didn't even know it was there so yeah yeah right to some points yeah so that's where the color issue thing comes in do you get it yeah and oh by the by the way the you know the default instagram like screen color is not dark mode but i enjoy using dark mode so most of my apps are like in dark mode at least for the examples i'll show here 